So let's start to look at the next part on how to add a URL link in Vue.js. So with Vue.js, we can also add links in here. So let's start to look how we can do that. Well, first of all, to do that, of course, we need to have a href. And here, of course, you will say, well, we have to put a domain name or a link URL. And here we could say, for example, I'm going to put in here chart.js3, which is my personal website. And then you might say, well, we want to have the HTTP s uh, slash slash www.chart.js3 dot com so if i save this of course this we have here but how do i put this in vue.js so to do this first of all we need to go here into into the data object and we can just put in here a new object or namespace and one of them will be here well let's say we're going to have here the uh the anchor i guess we can say the anchor text and we can just say here chart js number three and then we put a comma here again, and then we're going to say here link, and the link will be https slash slash www.chartjs3.com. I can save this, and of course now let's start to convert this. So the first thing we can convert that one, that will be very easy, we can just basically copy all of this structure. But then of course remove this and put in here what the text is, let's look at it, which is the anchor text. So we put that in there. If I save that, refresh, you can see here chart.js3 is showing. So next one here, you might say, all right, so probably for the next one, we can just copy this and just put that in here and then with the name of link. If we do this, you will notice that this will not work. If I click on this, and if I click on this here, you can see here, we get a completely different link. And what it is here is, I guess, uh, it just grabs the literal per item of this. So that is not what we want because this is apparently not correct. So how can we do this? Because this is what we call an attribute and this is the href attribute. We need to do it slightly different for Vue.js. So what we need here is, first of all, we need to put in here a bind. So we need to combine something. So it's a bind v dash bind, meaning we're going to bind a attribute and the attribute will be here and then we can say here the column and an href. So that's the attribute here. So we'll, of course, we have also another one like click attributes, all these kind of options. But in this case, we have the href attribute and here now, now it will understand that the, uh, this is a uh, Vue.js command, meaning we don't have to put in these uh, curly braces. All we need to do here is just to grab the namespace itself, which is the link and Vue.js will automatically convert this. So if I save this now, refresh, oh, let's put this back here. Let's refresh this. And now if I click on this, you will see here now we are getting the specific website, chartjs3.com, which is my personal website. So as you can see here, that's the only difference here to bind a value. 